Yo, what's up guys you welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna be teaching you guys the stochastic oscillator divergence strategy all right so guys the stochastic oscillator divergence strategy is one of my method which i use to rob my forex broker okay so i'm gonna be teaching you guys stochastic oscillator divergence strategy today Alright, so this strategy is very very easy and very very accurate. Okay, I can see it is over ninety percent accurate. Okay, and it is very very easy to learn and understand. Okay, so only if you are serious. Alright, so this is this strategy is one of the account flipping strategy which I use. Alright, so guys, and this strategy have um so many topics. The strategy the time frame the entry and the psychology all right so i'm gonna be teaching you guys the the strategy okay so guys i'm gonna be teaching you guys the strategy and the time frame today okay so guys first of all let's go and add the indicator which you need for this strategy so first of all let me remove the indicator so this is our clean chart now so let's add the indicator back to our chart again and then let me start showing you guys um the stochastic oscillator divergence strategy so on your mt4 or mt5s you click on this f icon here you click on main window you click on this plus icon here so you will scroll down and then on and then you will see stochastic oscillator so you will see stochastic oscillator here on oscillators so click stochastic oscillator the key percent period should be five d percent period should be three slowing should be three price field should be low and high method simple level should be 20 and 80. all right so the time frame should be all time frame guys all time frame and then um and then main signal should be green signal should be should be red all right so then so then you click done all right so after clicking done this is how it is going to look like on your chart so this is how it's going to look like on your chart. So guys, let me start showing you guys examples. Okay, so guys, first of all, this strategy works with trend, the market trend. This is why this strategy is so accurate. Okay, so this strategy works with trend. Whenever market is moving in an uptrend, we look for buys, and when market is looking is dropping, we look for sales. Okay, so that's why we always win when trading with this strategy so currently now we can see that market is moving up guys okay so market went up it dropped it went up again okay and then it dropped back to this level here again but not up to this previous position okay so making it to continue moving in an option but on the suggestive or little whenever it drops below the previous low here on the suggestive oscillator and then on our research it didn't drop up to the previous low but on the suggestive oscillator it drops below this previous low okay so it means that there is a divergence and then the market will surely continue moving to the upside so this is when i enter my trade okay so after i look for an entry around this level here then i'll enter my buy trade and then from there it will just go up most time I target this previous high. Once it reaches here, I can just close out all my trades. And you know, a move from here to here is not a, a small move again because this is the four hours time frame. All right, so you back big profit already. Okay, so guys, let me explain again. Whenever the market is moving in an uptrend, it forms a high, 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 low, high, high, a high, low, and fail to break this previous support. But on the suggestion of little, it broke its previous support. Okay, dropping below, especially this 20 moving average. So that is an entry. You just look for an entry or buy. Okay, 
you will come to sell also but let me keep showing you guys for examples here okay so guys here is a sale example so for sale whenever a market from a high 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 to a higher high here but on the stochastic it broke the previous high but on our main chart it didn't break the previous high so look at what i'm trying to explain so this is the first high here and then this is the second high here right now but on the stochastic oscillator it broke this is the first high here and then this is the second line okay so if you put your horizontal line you will see that it broke the previous line so we are looking for sale at this area here now you just start looking for sale. so immediately after this pin bar you can just click on sell you see the market drop and drop so you can target this previous support area so here you can close out all your trade at a very big profit okay let me keep showing you guys more example because i really want you guys to understand the concept of this strategy all right so here is another example already okay so this is the high here and then the market went up and formed a new high here again but on the statistic of little you see this high here it broke this previous this previous low okay it broke this previous low and then it dropped before it dropped below the 20 level and anything that dropped below the 20 level that trade is a very good trade okay just take it any divergence that go below the 20 level just take it in fact that's the only one which i trade and then anyone at the supply and demand area in your chart okay so those are the best divergence so guys you see it dropped below the 20 level here and then this one here didn't even drop off of this demand area here so this is a very short divergence it means the buyers are still in control so you see the way the market moved from there after the rejection so it moved away from there so at this resistance here you can close your profit okay any profit from here to this area here you can already close your profit guys okay so i'll show you guys another example again guys okay so guys this is another example here so you see this low and this low here okay so this is the low here and the low here so you look look at how this one happened here and then on our stochastic this is how it happened but this setup is not that legit because it didn't go below the 20 level okay so i'm not sure i will even take this trade i want a perfect one Okay, so guys, that is how we do it here. I've given so many examples here already, guys. I've given so many examples here. All right. So guys, um, this is that is how we trade the statistic oscillator divergence strategy. Okay, there are still more to this. All right. So guys, um, if you enjoyed watching this video, make sure to smash like button and also make sure to subscribe to the channel for more. Thank you so much.